on Inanimate and Sandy. So, I was doing my recap as usual, and yes, I'm recapping a recap within a recap, when Mephone rudely pushed my recap off the cliff as part of making everything like the first episode for the one year anniversary. I really don't want to talk about it, so let's just say, long story short, I'm pressing charges. Anyway, as part of that anniversary stuff, Mephone changed the animation style back to the old one, yeah, remember that? And absolutely everyone hated it. <gasps> Eventually, he changed back near the end of the elimination, when the final two was down to either Apple or Bomb, and it turned out being that betraying, backstabbing Bomb. Speaking of backstabbing, Marshmallow touched a nerve with some other contestants when she called them idiots in a rage once she heard the next challenge was doing a cool dive off the crappy cliff. In the challenge, everyone did terrible, honestly, terrible, even paper, with his tool due to him winning the previous challenge. But Pickle, despite his impaired vision, did the best dive. Yes. Yeah. And also in honor of the first episode, voting for who was eliminated was up to the contestants it determined. Let's hope for once their decision-making skills have a hint of logic. And that's what you missed on, Inanimate Insanity. Hey Paper, what's up? I'm trying to figure that out myself. What do you mean? Well, just look. I'm a monster. I opened my eyes and I've hurt somebody. Or lost the challenge. I'm just digging my own grave. If only I knew what was causing this. Well, maybe we can find out. Did you have this before you went to Idiotic Island? Ah! That doesn't concern you, since you're gonna die! Huh? What? It happens again, didn't it? Yeah, but I think I found the problem. Evil paper is triggered by the word Idiotic Island. What did you call me? Uh... It's because I'm extremely smart. Duh. So, time to vote, huh? Yeah, for you. Oh, come on. I said I was sorry. We don't speak high-pitched squeaker language. Apple, now you're just being as bad as Marshmallow. Yeah! Buy a chair. Elimination time. Da -da. Welcome back to the elimination area. Now with the voting box. Go there and vote for the contestant you dislike the most. I am sick and tired of that kiwi. Or, or is she a lemon? or guava. Marshmallow, I am not an idiot. I have like a 43 IQ, and that's above the average cucumber intelligence level. I check. Apple has to go. I can't stand to have another fruit-based object with that kind of intelligence. Marshmallow is me. Apple is out of here. Two words. Marshmallow. Wait a minute, that's four. My apologies. Hmm, let's see. Who should be next to go to Idiotic Island? Wait! Uh, OJ! You are out of here! So, after counting up the votes, we have three votes Apple, three votes Marshmallow, and one vote for OJ. OJ! I'm sorry. I had another... It's okay, Paper. I understand. Oh, great! Well, this is the second time two people have had the same amount of votes, so we're gonna solve it the same way as last time, with a tiebreaker. All you have to do is answer one question. The first contestant who answers correctly stays, and the other will be sent to Idiotic Island. <laughs> what is 12 times 2 divided by 2 times 2 divided by 2 again minus 6 plus 1? 7! And it's correct. What, what? What? How did you know that? My lucky number always works. Does that mean I'm eliminated? To make a long story short, yes. <laughs> hey, Marshmallow! Welcome! No! Final six! Awesome! We are really almost done now. And to get this show started, it's time for the inanimate Smackdown Wrestling. So we're going to go into a tournament bracket. So let's get started. First up, Bo and Apple. Oh dear, a two inch pink ball. I'm horrified. Pickle, because you won the last contest, you get these punching gloves. Alright, you're going down, you loose leaf. Yeah, I guess I am. Oh, what? That's no fun. You're supposed to be angry and stuff. Man, you're no fun to mess with. Fight me! Get that thingy away from me! That's better. Now we can have a real- Okay, even though we're friends, Taco, I will destroy you! Huh?
<laughs> What's going on here? Why won't you fall? I'll never fall. Uh... <laughs> now we have three still in the running. However, because we have three competitors, one has to automatically advance to the finals. And that contestant is Taco, because she beat her contestant in the least amount of time. Oh, I've been having some psychological issues I'd rather not talk about, so I don't think I should. Oh man, Paper, you lost? If we don't step it up, we're both going to be sent to Idiotic Island. Apple, what are you doing? What? It's fun. Idiotic Island, 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 Idiotic Island. Oh, I think he's unconscious. Aw, he's dead. Let's poke him. You don't understand. He may be injured. Paper, wake up. Paper. Paper! Paper! Uh, where am I? What, what was that? Uh, currently, we're located in a rather unstable location. This is my head for the moment. You've been having difficulties recently in keeping it under your control. I just don't know what's going on with me. Well, lucky for you, these issues will come to an end. Right now. <laughs> You're weak, pathetic. You might as well just hand me over the key that unlocks your mind. You want a key? How about 88 of them? <laughs> yeah, cause of death is unknown. No, it didn't have anything to do with one of my challenges. I can't be held respon- Um, never mind, okay, bye. Paper, so glad you're back. Hey, Paper, guess what? Idiotic Island! Uh, hey, I'm cured! Oh, this? Oh, they needed to cut me in half to get me out of that stupid hole. You did it, Paper. You conquered your evil self. Aw, I liked it when you were Mr. Angry Eyes. Anyway, you missed it. Taco destroyed Bo in the arena. <coughs> anyway, everyone's up for elimination except Taco. So, vote for one of these contestants by May 7th. The next episode comes out on June 1st. Hey, I just realized, isn't someone missing? Yeah, nobody showed up last month. Was someone supposed to? Oh, uh, guys, do you see that? What? What is that? 